Welcome to Procrastinators Anonymous Anonymous, The Last of Us 2 edition. Oh, I got to get one of those fucking uh, templates of the guy choking him or something. It'll draw me and Joey. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh, I'll, God. Uh, I'll find one for you. Hey, guys. Hey, guys. Jelly here, your local trans hater. Uh, uh, here, back <laughs> at it again. You know, that crazy, kooky guy. I, I don't understand how anyone can look at the leaks that are coming out for this game and be like, yeah, that's a good game. Yeah, yeah, that looks good. Yeah, let, let, you know, let's kill fucking Joel. Let's have the trans Jelly. character that we're trying to promote. Kill Joel. No, Je- kill Jelly, no, you don't. Joel. Oh, oh, and then you have to play you as the trans character. Oh, so you feel sorry for them. Oh, you Jesus don't understand. Christ. You don't understand. It's not about fun. It's about an experience. It's oh, about, yeah, I'm sorry. It's a, I'm sorry. It's we don't use the word Because life is hard. Here. And... Yeah, we don't use the word fun around here. We, we don't like to use the word fun when we're talking about video games. Fuck you, Ben, when you said that on your podcast when Nate brought it up and you're shitting on Nate. No, video games are supposed to be fucking fun. That's the point of fucking... Oh, it's art. A uh, fuck art. I mean, Ben did like Depression Quest, so I don't know. If- oh, he did? You mean the book? No, no he played the game. Uh, I know, but it's name? a book. Zoe game. It's, yeah, a, it's book a book, too? No, no, no. It's, like, just words. It's not a game. It's just a book. It's not? Wait, it's a, it's a game only Have you a played, name? It's just it, text? Yeah, it's text. It's a, you, you choose choices. It's a text game. You can choose choices. And there's some Jesus pictures, I think. Jesus fucking Christ. You did not know that? What did you think it was? No, I thought, I thought it <laughs> was a game. Oh god, uh, Ashley oh my Johnson god. is in this too? Oh, I'm, no. I'm double down even more. Fucking Gamergate forever. <laughs> <laughs> god yeah. damn, it was a text game? Are you shitting me? Yeah, of course. Oh, Hold on, I'm was... trying to see if Neil Druckmann is Jewish. Give me a second. God damn it. <laughs> god damn it, he's fucking Jewish. Be, you gotta be you fucking kidding beard? me. You gotta be fucking kidding me. No. I'm dead ass serious. It says it's real <laughs> on his fucking Wikipedia. Yo, yo, yo. You know, no, really? God damn it. You gotta be fucking shitting me. I knew oh, it. You know, I Chris, fucking knew Chris it. D'Elia is Jewish too. I fucking knew it. How am I always right? How am I always right? Every time there's some fuck shit going on, you go up high enough in the letter. Oh, look at that. There was a Jewish guy somewhere in the mix. It's, they're, they're, not not even they're not even hiding uh, it. They're not even hiding it. See tools here. Welcome See to Pro Anon Anon okay. Ana 2, where we fucking shit oh, on Last shit. of Us 2. Come to the God Pro Anal. Oh my I just, God, we, we just had a head. big fucking revelation because Neil Druckmann is Jewish. Do you know that? Oh my God, what? Yes. I am surprised, actually. Because I'm not. Subversion. <laughs> Of course you're not chilling. No. <laughs> Damn it. I should have known. I should have known with, with the man, with the name man at the end of his name. I should have known. <laughs> should have mm. known. It's only your man fault. Man with two ends. Oh, he's not even trying to hide it. He's an Israeli-American <laughs> writer. God damn it. Oh, Jesus. Oh, boy. Fuck. God, of course. Of course. The, of the, course sub, the subversion. so blind? And yet so correct at every time I, I bring up the Jews. <laughs> every time. It was no. It's it's like you've been trained to have the sixth sense about them. It's it's almost like, huh, there's a pattern here. Huh, Silverstein. Huh, huh, Epstein. 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 Weinstein. Weinstein. Uh, Weinstein. God. Fucking What what do you See, think? Have of you last heard about the Yeah. Have you heard about this um, stuff? They're gay, right? That's all I remember. No. What? She's gay. Well, yeah, I mean, yeah, I guess, yeah. She's At gay. Least. No one had like, a problem see, with that. Like, is, literally, yeah, no one. been so then, blown out of the fucking water because of all this extra bullshit that they've been throwing in this game. Like, I don't even care. I don't even care anymore. We're past that. We. <laughs> <laughs> what, do, what do they do to The Last of Us 2? What they so, do? Ooh, there's a trans wait, woman. Wait, wait, you've heard that. And that's There's not inherently tr- problematic. What the problem is that they're they're, that's they're okay, forcing so, her cock tr- all the way up your ass, and you didn't. Yeah, no. so a trans it. woman kills Joel. Then oh. you play as the trans woman, and then there's a scene where some you other guy that looks it. like yeah, you, have oh, you have to oh, kill Ellie. Trans- you have to murder Ellie. Like Ellie is the this. final that's villain or super whatever. Fucked. Like, ah, uh, yes, we're gonna have inclusion, and then they use their inclusion, like their inclusive character, to kill. Yes, you know, it let's like- have our one trans person 
literally kill our, just, everyone's just favorite you, character. Just no, no, yes, it sounds man, like a conspiracy the main to make um, Scullin with sounds a like a conspiracy. Club. Sounds like a conspiracy to make trans people uh, like sound like awful people who just kill everyone you love. Hmm. Oh no no no! Neil Druckmann's like the most um, you know pro all the things people ever. Sure? He, yeah, you yeah. Reno, you can't. Because they killed your dad. I think that. No, oh no, my no. god! He, oh god. my god! He literally. <laughs> he, told, he had a speech. He had like a like. There's a video of a speech where he was like. He's explaining the concept of The Last of Us 1, and he was like, oh, you know, like, the, the virus, like, only infects women, and they turn into, like, monsters, but, like, Ellie's fine or whatever, and he's like, oh, I realized this was very misogynistic, and then I, I started listening to this amazing podcast called Feminist Frequency by oh, Anita Sarkeesian. Oh, no, 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 cast, cast, you cast <laughs> me, how could you? Oh, uh, God. You know, I'm going to go back to my Chad games from the 2000s. Um, here is oh, yeah. my Oh, yeah. Luigi's uh, Mansion. M. Lemon had, had a poll where he was like, pick like one decade of games and like you can't have the other. It was like the 2000s versus the 2010s. And I was literally, I was yeah. very stumped. I like I the 2000s. Yeah, I like I like the two thousand mm. games. There are a lot of different interesting things. I don't have room for Pikeman. What the fuck do you mean? Um, coming out, but most importantly, I really like Heroes of Might and Magic. I am awful at it, but I will just play it forever until I am good because I can have an army of Gwyffins destroy demons, and it's fun. <laughs> it's great. <laughs> You guys should try it sometime. Uh, forget, forget about the trans person who killed your dad. Uh, come with me. Be enlightened. Oh, there's Have more. Oh no! What else? What else did the trans person uh, kill? There's there's this character who who's who looks exactly like Neil Druckmann, who fucks oh, the tranny. Fucks- yeah, I yeah. remember this because like the voice. She looks. She also looks like the voice actor, right? Or something. Yeah, she, looks she looks like a real person. No, she was he... uh, fucking. What is it? Motion captured by a real like hot girl. And yeah, they figured like yeah. the sex scene was probably like the the director just wanting to fake fuck this girl. Yeah, just, you know, just dry hum- just dry hump with those like motion suits on. Yeah. Oh, we can't wear underwear yeah. underneath the motion just, suits. Like, you know, it uh, messes up the the capture. It messes up the. Uh... Uh-uh. The CGI, yeah. the CGI would be terrible. Yeah, uh, technical stuff. Yeah, you wouldn't, you wouldn't understand. Just, uh, just bend over. It's just like I, uh, yeah. I, I'm, I'm just, <laughs> I'm gonna put it. I'm gonna put it in a little. You know, just, just the tip. Just, uh, <laughs> yeah. for, for, for realism. You know, authenticity. Uh, for realism. <laughs> that's what, the, yeah. that's what mm. the, uh, that's what the console people want. Yeah. That's what yeah. Doing. You're not supposed to enjoy that's what it. This it's industry not fun. needs. I say as <laughs> he says having as sex he with enjoys women. it. Yeah, and she probably did not. Uh, I'm sticking oh my, my cock in for art, not yeah, not like it's you know. not it's not to, uh, my anything else. Just art. I'm listening mm. to Neil Druckmann's special message about Last of Us Two. Oh, oh yes, uh, we're just so happy about the art direction. What art direction? There's literally no art direction in this fucking game. It's a yeah, realistic it's ju- game. It's literally just. Direction? It's literally just realistic Sony game number eight. Ah, no, they need to feel like they have something to live for. They need to feel like they're oh, new oh, and innovative. Oh, like guys, they're like, not. guys, he like, just finished a playthrough and he was he was crying after it was done. Guys, I swear it's a good game. Guys, he was crying. Well, of course, it was. It was it's uh, of course he was crying. Jelly. It's the Schindler's List of video games. It's it's a crowning achievement. And, and then and then when when he was done with the game, he finished his soy latte and asked his girlfriend if if Tyrone was done fucking her yet. Yeah, and asked. Uh, he said if she no, had... no, she, no. He isn't. Tyrone is long gone. She just doesn't want to spend time with him. <laughs> yeah, that's the real sad she, part. He wanted he wanted her to peg her, but like you know the she was like oh you know the the big spiky uh, dildo is kind of kind of used up right now. We, we need to boil it some other time. It's already clean. She just she just doesn't want to touch him. Yeah. That's the thesis. How do you feel about fun video games, Tool? 
Um, I'm playing a fun video game right do think, now. Do you think video games have to be fun? Is it okay for video? Is fun retarded? Is fun bad? C tool. Uh, fun is not bad. However, you can have um enjoyable experiences that are well, not enjoyable. You can have experiences that are just torture that are also as much games as um yeah, there's, as fun games. There's got to be fun somewhere. I think okay. So I I I'm like. I'm like, I've got a real hard on for Pathologic. Pathologic is not a fun game. <laughs> Why do you it play is, it then? Uh, Pathologic or Pathologic? Uh, Pathologic. Because I love suffering. That's why. What you want to know my favorite thing uh, about this video is that I'm watching? What? Uh, uh, it has 127,000 dislikes. Uh, mm. And the comments are turned off because they're cowards. Fuck you, Naughty Dog. What are you Ooh. scared because people are going to tell you what your game fucking really is? Yes, oh, you they know, are they, scared. Dude, they have been DMCAing the shit out of everyone who talks about this. Oh, stuff. don't talk shit about our game. Oh, please. Oh, no, don't mention about how our director's wrong. <laughs> Was not there a director? I just, I'm so fucking. Yeah, I, yeah, I'm game. so. Fucking annoying people can't accept it. they make a shitty product. The people who fucking uh, did the Sonic movie, which I think was a fucking psyop, by the way, uh, they admitted that their design was shit. <laughs> they admitted it was shit, and they fucking fixed it. These fucking pieces of shit aren't doing that. They're like, no, no, it's good. No, it's really good. No, we worked really hard. That means it's good. Mm-hmm. You want to hear my? You want to hear my psyop theory about the Sonic movie? Yes, hit, well, let me hit me with that theory, that so, film theory. Uh, it was all ploy. Yeah, the entire this. fucking time was a fucking ploy. They 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 made that trailer specifically with that bad looking Sonic design to gain hype around their movie because they knew oh, they knew for they sure. Yeah, no um, one gives a yeah. fuck about it. I yeah, real no one gives a fuck. So they intentionally made a bad looking product to get attention, and then they like, oh, don't worry, guys, we'll fix it. Wink, and. They quote unquote fixed it, but really the movie had that second character design the whole fucking time. I honestly uh, ready, very viable, up. very viable NGL. I and don't I would put have out to the game, Jurgen. I I understand they can't fix an entire game in a year. Don't put out the game. If you can't yeah, fix just it, delay don't it. put it out. Just listen. I know you're all shit on Yandere Dev for never putting out his game, but better never put out a game no. than to put out a shit game that everyone Maybe ever says. The day, is, Maybe. The day it comes out, it, it will be perfection Maybe itself. We didn't need The Last of Us 2. You, you ever think about that, guys? We always think about what we could do. We never think about what we should no, do. No, surely yeah. not. Surely, you gotta keep the franchise going, Jelly. Oh, no. I don't, Jurgen, I don't feel sorry for people who go into video game development. It's not a stable career path. You chose that career path. No one forced you to be a video game developer. You chose that. That's why your fucking. You just, yeah, why yeah. Did you if you're worried about losing your job, be a fucking programmer. And I know it's a meme, mm-hmm. but literally be a programmer if you're if you're yeah, worried about job security. Like, if and you they want. can treat you like they can get away with treating you like shit because they know like. Yeah, and it's a shit or or whoever not, can just like not, open the window and like curl an application at some crazy fanboy outside. Like, like yeah, like, we'll take you. When you're a video game developer, you're not working on art that you want to do. You're working on art that some fucking Jewish is, banker is payrolling you to do. So some like, Yahoo's what you're saying is that they should either dream. They should either become really, really good at shaggy impersonations and do yes. that. Oh, they I'm should live in the middle. Oh, they should If you're a video game developer, you're artistically bankrupt. You can quote okay. me on that. I, or you could stay you in the, for the, a big the company. middle of nowhere where you rent is work, really cheap like a, and be unemployed. You actually wants to. Mm. Like, I don't think he wants to. You fuckers are not fucked in the ass by your higher ups and you're loving it. Isn't that just, um, like, they I hate to be free. a little communist, but they isn't that just capitalism? Dune, the Janies, no. you're free. <laughs> what are you saying, C Tool, about communism? I, I said, I said, isn't that just the nature of capitalism that some people will be oh. forced into shitty jobs that they hate because they just need to get done? 
And like the good no, jobs they can't get. That, that's the nature so of sorry. communism. <laughs> I'm going to be real with you. I mean, it's not yeah. so much communism as anti capitalism. That yeah, was a pretty anti capitalist sure. thing. No, it's not a capitalism takes, thing. You can't take advantage of dumb people, but I don't feel sorry for them because you shouldn't have been dumb in the first place. I fucking get like, smart. The internet is a thing. Everyone has no excuse to not be an idiot. The internet is there. Use it. Wait, wait, wait. Literally, so. literally all of human knowledge is at your fucking fingertips. You have no excuse. I love how passionate you are about that. It's, it's great. It, it makes me happy. I'm just really <laughs> pissed off. So how, is this, how is this a capitalist thing? Like, um, it like would, they could, these are okay. You look at the visuals, like these are clearly like very talented. 3D yes. people, like 3D. No, no you know, doubt. But the fact of the matter is that a lot people. of um, they could okay. go work on something where they're treated better. They, they could the hypothetically. Here's the thing, right? It's not That's like not profitable though. Yeah, it's not. That's the thing. Uh, it's not a profitable job. So even if they're very talented, well, they will always make shit. Like Call of Duty does so well because they probably treat their employees like shit, make them oh. pop out a shitty game every year because it makes then billions go, of dollars. Then go indie or like get a no, side. Oh, I agree. Job. Go indie. Don't work yeah. for a fucking corporation. You're retarded. I would say going indie probably better than being a corporate shill. But going indie sure. also comes with a variety of risks and a level of like responsibility that some people money. simply can't handle. We, we yeah, don't have a fucking. We don't have fucking middle like we have AAA developers and indie developers. We don't have like single yes, and double A developers. Like we don't have fucking. A. We don't have fucking THQ anymore making made like SpongeBob tie-in games anymore. Like it's you. You have to get the big company. Of where's fucking nothing. where's the Incredibles two for PC guys? I say that as but like seriously, like no joke. Yeah, no. I, we need fucking games that are not big between. budget, like million dollar awesome. games. But like you know what we really need? Even, even even indie, indie games. games. I'm so sick of realistic graphics. I'm so fucking sick of it. Listen, yeah, you know what we really indie need? games are really samey. Like, and, and you know like... what? <laughs> you know what? It's not even the corporation's fault. It's you fucking consumers out there. You fucking, yes. fucking hungry yes. soy boy fucking. consumers. You're the problem because they're only slack the judge, smooth only brain. exist and only deliver a product because there's a fucking demand for it. I mean, yeah. you know, you could blame Your little the consumers. Cop sleeves are just sucking it up. You could blame the consumers, or you could blame the capitalistic system in which we are all forced no. to live in. That no, the, thing is, the thing is, people, I don't people feel sorry. Smarter, for people. it would work. Sorry. It's only I mean, it's valid. I'm not. I'm not saying you have to feel sorry for stupid people. I'm just saying that stupid people will naturally be like this because this is how the system is. Like the, the stupidest people will always be like this in this system. Stupid That's, people be like. Stupid people just be like that. I mean, like, if they didn't, the only reason they have a thousand microtransactions in games is because people will buy them. And I, I hate yeah. those people. Uh, Jogan told me, Jogan's saying in the chat that the double A games do exist. And yes, they do. Uh, they're just not as much as they used to be. Such as? Yeah. And I'm sure there's. Like, I'm we not, need I mean, to what do we in the middle class market if we're going to tell me. Like, uh, tell me. What, what's the definition of a double A game? I don't even know what the fuck that is. I haven't heard uh, of that. It, it's, it's not like a hard definition. It's just, I mean, I give THQ as an example. So, you, like, you know, triple A games, that, oh, that's really? slightly less good. Okay. I like. A lot of um, Japanese developers I'd consider double A, like Platinum. Okay. Okay, so they're, they're a corporate wait, wait, wait. How is but they're not like a fucking Infinity War. Not when they make a game with fucking Microsoft yeah. and Nintendo, but when they make like Bayonetta with Sega. It's like, that's double A. Yeah. Sega's Sega. double A. Yeah, that's the thing. It's it goes It all goes back to the fucking realism meme and then becomes this big mm. project with all this money and all the, these, like, they need all these big corporate partnerships to even fucking make the fucking game. Yeah. Yeah, because people won't buy games that aren't like super too high estate. stakes. Um, I'd like to. I know I'm playing Heroes of Might and Magic now, so I'm very biased. But consider if we just went back to the days of good old Heroes Might and Magic, where you had really shitty 3D models. I'm playing Heroes Might and Magic three. I know it's like a five and stuff. Um, and you just you have them fight on a little grid, and it's cool and it's fun, and you destroy things. Uh, consider yeah. this. You know what was all this problem? What? I, I, the, if we didn't have a fucking system that was uh, uh, currency dependent, 
where you can only you have to do things in order to get currency in order to fucking survive. Hey, hey, that's Jelly, capitalism. sweetie, oh, that's capitalism, baby. <laughs> it's almost as if it's almost as if if we literally just make robots to do everything for us and then take yeah. the profit that we get from them doing the work and give it to us so we can be happy and do what we want. I mean, the one percent exists, and I'm I mean, sure they're doing happen. that, and having a having a grand well, it's not old time. Happen but... Because of a certain hand wringing group of individuals, <laughs> so you know what I mean. The one yeah. percent, yes, that certain, certainly don't certain, make up any ethnicity. A certain small hat wearing group of uh, <laughs> yahoos. The Muslims, oh, yeah. I understand. Yeah. How long until we no, get no, taken no, down for hate smaller. speech? <laughs> I know. <laughs> I know. It's coming. I'm no. I, most rich people. I'm are. just. I. I'm so. Vin, I feel so fucking vindicated to know that fucking Neil Druckmann is a motherfucking Jew. <laughs> I'm glad. I I'm call it every you, time. I'm happy for you, Joe. You can call me an anti-Semite. You can, but I'm right. I'm still right. <laughs> yeah. An anti-Sem right, one might. So? Yeah, an anti sim right. Hey, am I am I right, Goyim? Yeah. Mm-hmm. Goyim? My, fellow, my fellow Gentiles. Oh Hell God. Yeah. God, this is the most disgusting podcast I've ever been a part of, and I love it. Can I get some? Can I get some shrimps in the chat? <laughs> can I get some shaloms in the chat, please? Can I finish this campaign? Can I get some foreskins in the chat? Uh, are we floundering? Can we go to emails? <laughs> Oh, yeah. yeah, the fucking email section. We've been teasing it for so long. No, yeah. no, we have to, to keep, keep them going. We have to keep blueballing yeah. them. You gotta keep... But, uh, it's because because it anonymous. I've got an go email. I've got an email. From, uh, let, me, let me open up our, our Yahoo account, because we use Yahoo, obviously. Because yeah, um, we, we love Verizon. Verizon. Because we love uh, Yahoo. Mr. I got an email from a... From a uh, uh, uh god how do i say this name differently uh 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 uh, uh, uh a meal a meal uh duck woman yeah sure <laughs> uh, meal yeah. Duck woman. Um, um, says hey hey guys have you heard of this game last of us 2 it's last it's a really it's a really cool looking game goy i mean uh, cons- uh, consume. I mean, potential Boys. customer. Uh, uh, you should really check it out. Uh, hashtag trans rights. You know, I think I will. Uh, meal. Uh, <laughs> what the fuck did I call you, meal duck woman? I think I will check out this game. It sounds right up my fucking alley. That's a very that's a very unique name. Is that was that French? Thanks, thanks for the email. Nice. Uh, oh, oh, he put he put in the. <laughs> he? <laughs> he, oh, sorry, she. Uh, at, the, at the end of the email, <laughs> strangely enough, they put um, <laughs> third time emailer, second time watcher. <laughs> 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 Which is weird because this is only the second time we've done this segment, so I don't know how they're the third time emailer. Ah, uh, they have access to time travel technology. They can send obviously. multiple emails. I don't know. It's not. It's not limited to one. For, okay. But no, anyway. no, that's how. That's how it works. <laughs> <laughs> All right, dude. You got any emails? Uh, let's. Let me. Let me. Let me rustle around. Uh, am I? Let me. Let me look it up. Yeah, <laughs> let me lock it. Yeah, an email. Let me unlock uh, my BitLocker and check the, my certain folders. Your yeah. certain folders, indeed. Uh, email. Like that? Yes. We have an email from. Oh my god. <laughs> okay. Hang on. Wait, okay, I just well, looked like I looked up um Neil Druckmann to confirm the the Jewish thing, but like I scrolled down. Fucking GQ magazine. <laughs> the last of us two. How Neil Druckmann made a masterpiece amid catastrophe. Mm. Oh god. Uh, there are games that are just comfort food. This is not one of them. Mm. Please. please. Are you sure about that? Should I stop uh, doing that? Am I too close? Yes. 
I mean, you could do it, I guess. It's it's segment. Well, I, I, don't, I don't even know how it sounds. I gotta it's, check it out. Listen to the podcast. Is it ASMR? It's just painful. I know, I do. <laughs> Listen, it sounds like I'm you're trying to corner busy. my market, which I'm not very comfortable with. Look, Dune Dune has got a juicy... What, what do you mean? Fag preggers will always be yours, Tito. No, please please give me that email. Yeah, I'm give him a, no, give him no, a juicy guys, email. He's dying for can, it. You, can, you guys can keep talking. It's fine. I, I haven't logged oh. into the account We're yet. We're <laughs> <laughs> that email. Oh, sorry. Do you need, uh, do you need the, the password to the Yahoo account? Yeah, Yahoo yeah, account. Yeah, <laughs> uh, oh, I get it. Uh, do all the emails uh, have to be about anti-Semitism? <laughs> I forgot what happened <laughs> in the first episode. Uh, not necessarily, but it is preferred. <laughs> we yeah, only you prefer get anti-Semitism the list. in our emails. Uh, I got an email. Uh, it says, uh, isn't it weird? Like, uh, it says, I was uh, a big fan of Digi, bro, before she became Digi Uh But isn't it weird how they uh, started ta- talking about uh, PSYOP bases near their house and then they became trans? Isn't that kind of weird? Oh, uh, my God. That, that is, that, you that know, e- dude, that is interesting. That email is from uh, a Mr. Uh, a Dune Coon. Uh, I don't know who that is. but uh, it's, Yeah, it's, it's, I, could, yeah. I couldn't imagine. It could be, it could be uh, anybody. You know, I wonder what that implies, Dune. Um, it's, it implies that this episode of the podcast News and Autos Anonymous is sponsored by The Last of Us 2. In stores now. Don't forget to reserve your digital copy, Goyam. Oh, God. <laughs> the cringe. I feel it heavily as I play my Steam video game that I only own digitally because I lost the physical copy 10 years ago. Uh, play us out, Dune. Get your, get your <laughs> 60 do- Sixty dollars ready to buy it on your outdated console. Oh, or you can buy it on PC. PC lasts forever. Your wife, um, you know, mortal. Uh, is it on yeah. PC? Uh, it That's should be. Doing. Oh, The Last of Us Two. No, it's PlayStation. Yeah, it's a, it's a Sony. It's a, it's like a oh, PlayStation. Oh, uh, in that case, uh, go hang yourself. <laughs> yeah. Console fags keep losing. Console fags. I blow swear. The fuck out. Oh my god. Console I, fags been wait. losing. Console fags are the only thing keeping up the whole like realism meme. Like it is the, entirely their fault. Like those two kind those of, actually. goddamn boxes. They, they need the a billion triangles, Kajo. Kajo, have you heard the, oh, the PlayStation 5 I, with the billion triangles? Oh. They need them. I was so oh okay, I'm gonna go off. I was so mad when like before the PS5 was announced, the IGN had that fucking uh, what was it? Unreal Engine Five trailer or like reveal? Oh, yeah, they show is. you how it works. Literally, literally, like not even joking. They're showing you like they're in a ca- like it's in a cave, and they're literally like, "Look at the rocks, guys! Look at the details in the rocks! Look at the eight trillion polygons in these fucking rocks on the ground, and well, so look how want- much we can change the lighting." Look, and look how much gameplay there isn't. He's walked through this fucking hallway. Consider if I wanted to experience a painting, I would have gone to the art gallery. Uh, exactly. Fucking make good video games, guys. Come on. It's it, the jokes. The jokes over. Stop making we, good we don't, games again. We don't, make, we don't use the word good around here, dude. Okay. That's too objective. I'm sorry. You that wasn't be. the artist's intention. Was for a good video game. Video games can never be art because uh, I forget. I think it fucking yes, donkey agreed. made this argument. At least I'm, I'm going to quote a donkey video. Where it was like, if they fucking remade Citizen Kane, people would be fucking ups and downs. But everybody wants every video game that's like ten years old to be remade. It's like obviously it's, you have no respect yeah. with like the original creator's intentions or any. None of that fucking matters to you people. <laughs> it's just just consume, guys. Oh, you know, fucking. <sighs> I saw this on 4chan today. The fucking this fucking Spurg Lord was fucking fucking getting his rocks off. Oh, oh, they're remastering Bloodborne. Oh, oh, who the fuck cares? Not Bloodborne. Why the Demon fuck do you care about remastering Bloodborne? Bloodborne looks fine the way it is. Why are they remastering? Wait, the are game? you sure it was Bloodborne? No, it said Bloodborne. It wasn't yeah. Demon Souls. No, they said Bloodborne. I mean, yeah, I know Demon Souls is getting a remaster, but they said fucking Bloodborne. 
Huh. I mean, it's fucking I fortune. So take it with a grain of salt, but I'm just like, yeah, yeah. Hmm. That's definitely a, a thing fuck? that people, can, yeah. Now that being said, I'm not against like graphically remastering. Halo Two Anniversary is the best looking fucking game in the world. That game is but that, nut. But that changes lit- very little about the original, and you can still play the original on that. Yeah, and you can still play the yeah. original. You just if it, that's the thing. If it was changes. if it was just a graphics bump, we would be fine. But it's never but, that yeah, they got to remake a, a graphics, it. Graphics, yeah. If it was just a graphics bump for new consoles, understandable. Remakes uh, are but, bad. But that's, but I that's think still remakes are desecration. Well, that's they still really like uh, fucking remaking a black and white film in color, which a lot of fucking people would be that very mad at you. true. I mean, you know I what you guess. can do? You can just color in the black and white film. We have the technology. But that, even even that, that still no. ruins the original aesthetic of the Don't film. Do that. Like, like they were valid. shot in black and white for, like, if someone made a black and white picture, I was like, this is like a manga. Like, coloring in a manga is not the same thing as a regular oh, yeah. black and white manga. Okay, yeah. I mean, here's the thing, right? So I know this like little thing about black and white films. But they specifically paint things like horrifically garish colors in the set to give it better contrast in the black and white. Yeah, um, exactly. I always and love can, that. Yeah, and it's, it's like it's an artistic decision. Uh, but the fucking people, if you wanted to make them Ooh. real, quote unquote, more realistic, uh, mm. that ruined the whole thing. I mean, it's very realistic for a colorblind person. Like, yeah, I guess. What do you guys think of that theory? Um, hey, Dune, do you remember Dick, uh, Dick Masterson's rant about the fucking, um, what's it called? That Black Mirror movie where you have to interactively like press shit on the TV remote. Like uh, the idea that movies and video games are like mushing and melding together and they're that's the thing they want to happen is that a thing they want to happen it's I a thing like some a, people want to happen some people want and i think it's gonna suck i think it's gonna i mean at that point it's just for people who like both choose your own adventure just watch a movie. Just I'm, so play video, fucking, yeah. I'm so sick of these fucking story fags. Oh, oh I gotta no, have a great yeah. story in a video game or it's not a complete package. It's a game. Play it. The gameplay should be the top fucking priority. I am a story fag, but I do agree that gameplay is the most important thing. Like, I love, okay, look, a good story, quote unquote, a good story does not mean like it has to be characters. a billion characters. It doesn't have to have like a deep and rich lore. Like Luigi's Mansion is a game with a good story because it's like, it is perfect for the game that it is. If there was like thousands of cutscenes where people are talking in Luigi's Mansion, it would be a bad story because that's not I what the game is about. Know. They just went on holiday and they were, they got spooked. Unless that's like Luigi's Mansion, the new one. <laughs> just just hours and hours of cutscenes of Luigi and Mario making Luigi and Mario noises. <laughs> <laughs> That'd be pretty and hilarious. And like reaction sounds like, oh, wahoo. Not going to lie, the idea of someone making that as a commentary on the state of the video game industry is kind of hilarious to me. Oh, I have this hot take. Yeah, any any game with an open world that has a, a fast travel button has a bad open world because the yeah. open world shouldn't be fun mm-hmm. to go around in. Like if the, if, it, if the, the open world is so fucking boring that you need a button to skip it, like then you've made a bad open world, I guess. Fucking yeah. nice uh, job. Or you, 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 like you, oh, you made it too big. Oh, you just made it too yeah, big. Too. I can understand the sentiment. I'm not really against fast travel. The what I would say would be a good compromise is fast travel should be an end game item that you get. Um, I think in Mamadora, a lot of fast travel you get, it's a core mechanic because the map does get relatively large for the way it is. Yeah, but like it's you can't take it. You can't take it out of like Assassin's Creed or something because it's like the game is built around having fast travel. I'm just saying. Games should not be built around fast travel. It should be built around having fun, engaging worlds that you want to explore all the time. Yeah. Like, if you have to go back and forth between two places on a map, then, like, every time, if there's a fucking, every time it should be fun to do. But, you know, it's too much work. It's too hard. Just make it a flat forest, and then you can fast travel. You don't have to worry about it. Uh, I can vibe with that. I think the big thing is because of, um, 
it's like a Metroidvania, and you got those 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 filthy hundred percenters who desperately want to get their their dirty little paws on everything that could possibly be in the game. But a lot those of people, open worlds yes. just have nothing. Like, what the fuck's in GTA V's world? Like, there's uh, nothing to do. <laughs> The, GTA so, 5 has an open you know, world. Yes. I've heard GTA, some people say that Breath of the Wild is too empty. Like, can anyone confirm? I haven't it's played kind it. of. I mean, that's fun to move around in, though. I like, I, I when I played it, I didn't fast travel a lot because yeah, it is fun Breath to go around. Breath of the Wild has actual art direction. So I'm like, not talking even, about online, Jake. I'm talking about the main gameplay. Looks good. Yeah, GTA. Uh, uh, but GTA Five is uh, fun to drive around in, though. Like no, see, see, uh, fu- here's my fucking problem with Rockstar. All right, I have a fucking bone to pick with Rockstar. Yeah, they they have vehicle driving mechanics on fucking point. No one does it better than them. I haven't played racing games. So I don't care. Uh, but uh, besides racing games, maybe no one does vehicle driving better than fucking Rockstar. But they can't do combat mechanics to save their fucking life. Holy shit! I like, Holy shit! It's so bad. The it's only... like it's like let's take Gears of War and then make it retarded. <laughs> That's what it is. That it's pretty one. basic, yeah. A uh, only saying, real, um... uh, Go ahead, Sorry. Sito. I was going to no. say, the only real open world game I've ever played, if you could call it an open world game, is just um, good old, good old Saints Row. Saints Row Saints has like Row. fucking goofy stuff in it, doesn't it? Yes, that's what makes it f- fantastic. You're driving around, you're a superhero, uh, you hit someone with your massive cock and kill, it's great. It's fantastic. So Saints Row is probably a better GTA, honestly. I've never played it, but it sounds it's- like so much fun you can play it multiplayer you know and another thing about rockstar all right i don't want to have to grind to get to the fun parts because that's how gta plays you have to grind to get to the fun parts to get the big tank so you can fucking ram the page through the city that's all i want to do i just want a tank just give me a tank i don't want to have to play the game for 60 hours to get a goddamn tank jelly why don't you play a good game called saints row (laughs) maybe i will yeah, literally Dragon just saying play in the Saints chat, Row. Uh, the online is the uh, only worthwhile part of GTA V. Uh, Not really. The online Not wasn't out. The online wasn't fucking out when the game came out. Yeah, it came out like a couple oh, months later. Geez. Online is the such game. a fucking. It's a wild west of fucking terror and constant uh, anxious uh, uh, dread because at any moment you just walk, you just walk down the street and you get fucking bombarded. Any motherfucker that sees you, they instantly start unloading on you. There is no, there is no peace in the world of GTA Online Five. It is pure chaos. Also, I like GTA Five, the story mode. I think it's fun. <laughs> like, I, I was shitting on it, Jerry, but uh, I actually do like the game. Uh, I never uh-huh. played online because it's fucking uh, because of what Jelly said. I'm glad. I'm glad you like GTA. I don't know. I just fucking love Saints Row. Saints Row was fantastic. I'm sure, yeah. And I'm sure ridiculous. I would like Saints Row too. I just haven't played it. Dude. Dude. Mm. Uh, give me a Fortnite and give me your Steam code. I will get you Saints Row. Oh, please, no. I could never. Uh, <laughs> See, I, I, love, I love your show, coy show. denial, but I know you want it. <laughs> Dude, Coon, she's paying reparations. Oh, yes. Pay- <laughs> I, Even though I, she's I not- the native... The Australian who is native to New Zealand is paying reparations to the yes, black man. As, yes. as you should. <laughs> I'm sorry Bow your country your sucks, dude. Have a, have a video game. Get your shoe polish ready. My, my point about the uh, fast travel, I have the same exact feelings about cutscenes. Like, if there's a skip cutscene button, you're fucking Has cutscenes. Like, obvi- like, if you know people want to skip the cutscene, then fucking change the cutscenes. Like I, I was saying this because I was playing Celeste earlier and I was streaming it a bit. I was playing Celeste and like that game has so much like unnecessary parts to the. I just want to jump around and get strawberries. Why do I have to listen to like fucking five hours of people talking about depression or whatever? Like it's not <laughs> like it's not congruent with the gameplay in any way. Like it has nothing to like the fact that you can skip it and have no impact on the game means that it's a bad cutscene. You know what pisses yeah. me off about Celeste and games that do this shit. 
when the character art okay, is hold on, hold way on. I gotta, I gotta, fucking, I gotta, get, I gotta yell at Jurgen. I gotta fucking yell at Jurgen right now. Because he says in the chat, because you can't see it on screen, he says, fuck you, skip cutscenes is the best feature ever made. Which should like I did skip all the cutscenes in Celeste, but I'm saying games should be designed so that you don't want to skip the cutscenes. Oh, like yeah. yes, it, gonna, it, it is good now give us in games. Option. Oh my Jesus fucking Christ! Fucking I ground up all those things. I couldn't keep them. Sure. I couldn't keep any of them. Huh? Sure. Would you want a button that skips the gameplay posts that you don't like? Like that makes no, no. sense. Why would they be in the game? Like that's exact. Mm. It's all it's, cutscenes and games should not be separate pieces. They should be part of one whole art piece because it's a game. It is not. Why is are they two? They should not be separated parts. It's like, oh, I don't like this music. Let's skip this music. Tra-. Like that makes no sense. It's the designed experience. Uh, it should be. Des- you know what? You're. Right. <laughs> yeah, I hear you. you, you guys, I hear you. <laughs> what you're sounding to I, me like. I'm totally on board right now. Like to me is like, no, you have to play the game that I and how I want you to play it. I am the author. No, but like, no, I'm the, saying it should be this is good. I mean, it it should all be good. No, it should be good. But like, at the end of the day. It. It's a market, and they're marketing to literally everyone that could have any interest in video games, and some people just don't want to fucking play hey, cutscenes. G- guess what? Well, fucking Mario games don't have cutscenes, and they're everyone. great games. Mario 64 doesn't have cutscenes, Skip. It's a fucking masterpiece. Like, what are you talking about? It's possible. No, I'm just, I'm just saying that... But, like, we're talking about 7 billion fucking people. Like, not you're, no one is going to make a game that fucking everyone that plays it will not want to cut the skip the cutscenes. It's just going to happen. Yes, but I'm saying, like, why are cutscenes treated differently than any other part of the game? I think that's okay. A good well, I guess because it's not gameplay. Like, it's literally just not gameplay. It you is. Know, you're playing people, the game it's still. It's part of the no, game. It's, it's not gameplay, it, though. You're just saying yeah, it's music a movie. Is, could, it's literally music a movie. Isn't, you're literally music watching isn't gameplay. I don't, I don't it, buy games it, to play a fucking movie. I buy games to play a game. But it should play, like, should factor into no the experience you know, of the gameplay. Stance. I'm gonna die on this fucking hill. No cutscenes in my video games. Get that shit I mean, out of I here. I would join you, but I think dude's making a good point. Like, if you're gonna have them, like, make them good enough that, like, no, I, I see what dude's saying. It's like if it's skippable. I mean, I, I guess, but like, just because it's skippable doesn't necessarily mean it's bad. No, you know, in Spider, the new Spider-Man game where they had the the button to skip all the puzzles. Like, why even put them in the game then if you know what? nobody wants to do that? Wait, wait, you're you're joking, right? Well, that's true. They had that's a, a true skip thing. The puzzles button. Yeah, you can just skip the puzzles. There's like puzzle mini games you can do. Like the whole the whole point of the Spider Man because I know the main gameplay draw for that is just swing around on big building Spider Boy go wee. Yeah. Then just so make that, that. Just make. Yes. Make so why are there puzzles? That, 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 that's my point. So why are, are there shit. dumb puzzles in the game? Why are there parts where you play as people who aren't Spider Man in that game? Why are there parts where you're not in, always in costume? Because nobody wants to be fucking Mary Jane Watson sneaking around when you could be Spider Man and it's a Spider Man game. Yeah, that's, hard like, agree. Same, hard agree. That's retarded. And I, think I, that's I don't a very take. And uh, Jelly, I don't want to say that every game should have cutscenes because uh, that's definitely not what I think. Like, if you're not going to make good cutscenes, just don't put them in. That's my. That's not. Don't put a cutscene skip. Don't put cutscenes in and then put a cutscene skip. Just don't put them in. Is what I say. I, I feel your sentiment. I feel you. I guess. I. I mean, like fucking. Like if I'm just playing the game again, uh, like like in Halo Two or Halo Three, like I've I've fucking seen these cutscenes a million fucking times. I don't want to sit through them every single time. Like I've seen this. Let's move on. I want to fucking kill brutes and and dab on elites as I fucking shoot them with my rocket launcher. I understand that. I understand the you know just re- the replay value of it. But uh, I'm not. I'm, I'm gonna be honest. I'm not really the type of person to replay games a lot. But I understand having it as like. I understand why it is there. Like, I'm not saying, like, why would anybody want to skip a cutscene? Like, I get it. I'm just saying, this is more like a ideological point, I should say. <laughs> of, like, just make the fucking, don't... No, so I agree. Right. You, you should make, make a cutscene that's so good you never want to skip it. Like, um, yeah. the intro to fucking Halo 3. Don't skip that. That's a fucking glorious cutscene. Yeah. Oh, yeah. He says as my finger hovers over the skip button, desperate. <laughs> <laughs> desperate to free myself. We're going to have, have, have to have a second email bit because I thought that was the end of the podcast. <laughs> not, not. We weren't flattering at all. We were, in fact, keen oh, and, and ready. If, and if we do start flattering, I've got a, I've got a fantastic left turn. One of my classic uh, left yeah, turns locked yeah. and loaded. 
Hold oh, on, I gotta she... read what Dune, uh, Kujo, uh, fucking Jurgen saying. He says, "What about character builds?" Okay, I gotta read what Dune said. Yeah, what about character <laughs> builds? Are you saying everyone needs to play as a tank, then a mage, then a healer? People can choose what option. That's completely different. That's no, I don't. I think, think that a at game all. that has all those different characters is also built to have all those different experiences, yeah. and that's the difference. Yeah, like yeah. you, each of those are made to be a satisfying experience in and of themselves. And even each like stories parts. and cutscenes branch off. Well, and, like, have Jurgen, they're ignoring parts of the game because done. you literally can't play as m- multiple classes at the same time. Like you can switch characters, but you can't play a tank and a healer at the literal same time. I mean, yeah, you can. It's called Paladin. So, like, you're you're just gonna have to like if you're playing an RP like an RPG is a completely different thing because it's not a linear like an MMO. Experience. Yeah, I'm talking about linear experience. Once yeah. you get to MMO stuff, like you can do whatever you want. That's like that's, that's a about, whole yeah, different like, ball game. Yeah, online multiplayer, which is my jam, by the way, is like a total totally different free for all. Uh, here's, I'm playing the greatest game ever, DCSS, which automates the boring bits, like having an auto explore button. I'm just the, why are the boring bits in a video game? Like, why? Why, why are there boring bits, Jurgen? Why would you play a game with boring bits? Is what I ask of you. Who hasn't moved, Lily? Lily, get closer to this. Yeah, you know, get out of here, Sheetal. <laughs> you know get out of here. <laughs> this is no. a dude. Can- Okay. <laughs> then why the fuck is everyone else in here, you little shit? Explain I don't know. It's, this, this, co- this podcast is a clusterfuck more than the original podcast. <laughs> I mean, did Rito even leave the call before you started? At some point, Rito wasn't even the, here. You left the, the call. Fuck at some point. You lost the entire heart of the call. No, the, the podcast, podcast is anything without Rito is is the plan yeah, on it. Oh shit! Glorious. I, yeah. I, I the only rule is that Rito can't be on it. <laughs> and and like he has to been on the call before and then leave and then like a couple hours later we get the inspiration to do the podcast. <laughs> that's that's glorious. Oh, he waited, he was here at some point. He was here. <laughs> well, we watched yeah, yeah, he was. Yeah, so it counts. It technically counts. You te- got in there. You got in by a technicality. <laughs> uh, Dragon says because uh, he's talking about the MMO stuff. The boring bits. He says, because they can sometimes present strategic changes, but a lot of the time it isn't important. Spacing is important with enemies and challenges. That is true, but the parts in between don't have to be boring. They don't. Yeah. Yeah. They can just make them good. You can, yeah, you can just have fun parts in the middle. Just make a good game. <laughs> just do it. Just so it. simple. Is, is DCSS a MMO? I don't know what DCSS is. I genuinely don't believe uh, it's that hard to make. I am watching the stream. I just wasn't looking game. at it. Yeah, if you're just having, if you're playing a game and you're not having fun with it, just take that part out. Yeah. Oh, it's like a dungeon crawler. Um, this is so out of my field of. I mean, I saw play. it, I and I thought for about. a second oh, you were playing. Retro. That um. I really don't know enough about it to t- comment on it. Oh God, what's that game? That game where you. Oh! Oh! Being- oh, oh, oh. An auto explore. That's just walking around, though. I'm, I kind of misunderstood your point. Yeah, just walking around. I, I mean, I guess that's fine. <laughs> and that's not that's not like a gameplay. That's just like a. I mean, that's I don't know. That's that's not really like intelligent does it work. Like uh, in fucking the new Mario Kart, uh, does it auto hold accelerate? I use that. Oh, I. <laughs> I'm fucking great at Mario Kart. I'll destroy you. It's just literally because the controller is uncomfortable. Uh, it's just yeah, like it's just, it, that's really it. Goddamn Joy Cons. You would never shit. like in Mario Kart Eight. You would never in Mario Kart Eight Deluxe. You would never not hold the uh, A button. So it's like just having it on all the time yeah. is a good option. Yeah. Auto explore. Auto exploring in a dungeon crawler is a good option. I'd say actually that kind of helps it go Mario on. Kart. Mario Kart on the Switch just makes me miss. Wait, what is auto exploring? Mario Kart. Exploring? Mario Kart. What? Um, it's just walking around for you instead of because it's. I feel like that's fine because uh, it's not really skipping it. It's just like making you do less tedious things. I don't like the that's idea. Funny. Okay, auto walking and like auto jumping. Like there's an auto jump feature in Minecraft. I don't like that shit. I want to like jump it? when I want to fucking jump. Don't I don't you, want the you, game jumping for me. You, that's I, that's yeah. helpful for going upstairs and stuff. No, it's, it's really not helpful because they're. You want because you have less control over your character when it doesn't turn it off. Can you, can, you, can you turn it off? You can, no, do yeah, it you can turn it off. That's what I'm saying. That's what I'm saying. Yeah. I mean, that's fine. 
I leave that, it that off because I don't, I don't like having less agency of the player character. Eh? Get the fuck out of here, Shinny. What? Well, Shinny, we're doing a podcast. I cross it anonymous, anonymous. Shinny, welcome to the show. Hi. Uh, do you have anything to say about The Last of Us or video games? We're talking about video games. Uh, yes. Um, video games, Last of Us leaks. That was ass, man. Did you see those? <laughs> yeah. Fucking, yeah. fucking way to push an agenda, am I right? Well, I was already oh. like having bad vibes when that um first trailer dropped. Way to with make that. a porno, right? Not even that. Know? Wait, there's porn yeah. in the game? Yeah. Oh, Read the chat. No. Oh, come on, Shane. Yeah. Oh, Be informed. No. I just got home from work. Fuck off. Oh, <laughs> you want to know something that'll blow your fucking mind? Yeah, blow, blow me. Blow or me. or it won't because you'll have expected it if you're black pilled enough. Uh, Neil Druckmann's Jewish. Are you surprised? No. Yeah, the girl thought. Ellie makes out with has the fucking biggest nose I've ever seen. Of course, someone on the team is Jewish. <laughs> Have you seen that? She looks like a fucking parrot. Oh my yeah. god! <laughs> fucking Snowy looking ass. True. I I I sort of thought that when oh I saw that god, trailer, it's, like it's, it's way insane. back when I was like, "What is this? It's it's grotesque. It's a big honker." Nothing against Jewish people. That's a very uh. No, it's it's, it's a big a, nose thing, really. It's a, it's a Middle East thing. It's a Middle yeah. East oh thing. god, it's so big! Look at that! It's oh, it's a god. triangle. That's oh, a that's god. a right triangle if I've ever seen I, one. She's got like the the curl like in her hair, but I guess Ellie had, Ellie does too. But it looks like you know Jewish people yeah, have, have she's like, got, the like curl really hair. dark black hair with curls. Yeah, that's how you know. She could no, be that's Italian. A schnoz. No. <laughs> yeah, she could be, she could be <laughs> Italian. Italian doesn't fucking look like that. Mediterranean people May looks like that. that. <laughs> May is literally Jewish. You hear yeah, me? May is Jewish. But like, She's gotta be. I understand what you mean. Somewhere. But like, May isn't like, I guess that color or doesn't have that thick of eyebrows or. There's a lot that goes into a person's physiology. I love thick eyebrows. God damn, that gives me diamonds. Uh, you say that, but like in real life, though. Yes. Really. Jelly is a man of culture, unlike you. No, no. I mean, having thick eyebrows is fine, but like the stuff that Jelly was posting before. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh. mm. That's like that's like too thick. You know what I mean? Oh, I got some Not, thick brows. Know. I can post later. Are uh, you like um? You like uh, Kiyun Satsuki's fucking eyebrows from Kill a Kill? Uh, yeah, I mean, Satsuki, I think, is a shit character design, but... I like oh, her eyebrows. hold on. Why? She's a great guy. <laughs> that was my first anime yeah, figure. She looks fucking... Katsuki. She looks ugly. No, um, she's seductress. No. I wanted to step on me. Yeah, sure, because <laughs> that does turn me up. It gets me fucking rock hard. Sasuke We're gonna have to end this podcast soon because I gotta go take care of something. If you know what I mean. Okay. Uh, it's fine, oh, no. Jelly. Just take you can care just of it mute yourself. Yeah, just just like mute yourself. Five five minutes. If Jelly's not here, it's not the program uh-huh. podcast. Because I don't want to hear yeah. it. I'm gonna have to do the same thing if you do it. <clears throat> I mean, just deafen yourself. Uh, do you guys anything else to talk about on the podcast? Though, I think I feel like we've wrapped it up. She, now that she needs oh, here, we can no, we can leave. No. We can stop. No, no, do you think, no. Uh, no, do, no. You, do you get okay? Here's my left. Oh, your left turn. Head. Yes. Uh, do you guys think um, what the fuck is it called? A cyberpunk to twenty seventy seven will be a trash fire? No, no. probably fine. No, no way. it actually sounds uh, like a sick game. It's a CG Maybe, CD Project Red game. How bad can yeah, it be? Yeah, so it's got it's uh, probably gonna be good. Yeah. <laughs> they make okay. good games. But, uh, that was a great unanimous agreement. Were you, we were you worried because there's a like a cock girl in there? Is that why you were worried about it? No, oh, no. It's just that like I don't know. Penis girl. There's, oh, no, there's, there's so many delays, and they're like market, and there's so much. Like, well, I'd rather them delay than marketing. you know. I just oh, yeah. I don't have any it. faith in any game that has realistic graphics because it's probably it's it, it's a yeah. money market. It's not yeah, that there's and no, it's been there's no they're really like teasing it. and talking about it for like, like I'm what, not impressed years because you five make years. I mean, they're kind of well, it takes like five years to develop a game. But and like, they're a pretty small company in the fucking Europe. They are quote unquote so, small. I mean, like when are. I see artists doing realistic yeah. looking art, I'm like, that doesn't impress me. You literally just yeah, copy what a human being looks Yo, you're like. You're imitating reality. I could fucking do that. It's not I mean, Cyberpunk 2077 sure? has sure? some 
artistic merit because it is cyberpunk. It's not just real. Yeah, they, I mean, they, they put yeah. realistic art, neon purple, purple pink, and blue in it. So it's you know cyberpunk. I mean, <laughs> yeah, bro, pink and purple go burr. Pink and yeah. purple Having a realistic art style is kind of still uh, artistic choice, crazy, but bro. but as a I mean, I big like AAA game. As a big AAA game, like you'll never see a big AAA game that's not Nintendo that has not a realistic art style. There'll always be that from now Ooh, on. Who is right? Kind of like how right. animated movies are all three D now, because that's just yeah. what people. Yeah, oh, they all look like the same fucking that. disgusting Pixar, up yeah. fucking Hate Incredibles Pixar bullshit ass. It's gross. Uh, Dragon, you well, did Dragon say that? Not, yeah, Dragon, you're well, literally retarded. It's not, it's architecture is not a a an imitation of real life it literally is what real the life what is wrong with you joking <laughs> what a, it's also, made out of real that? things <laughs> how fake could it be like why would you has, like why so would... many stylistic choices in it. exactly why why would you do like, waste all this time and energy and money to literally just copy real life that's boring how many uh, polygons are on the taj mahal yeah. Oh jeez! Oh, oh no! You can't even measure like like if you look at it with one of like Vegeta's like you know the eyeglass scouter, thing, it just explodes. Yeah, it just <laughs> blows up. The teraflops. I'm more impressed with like to even Catholic, look at it. Gothic, Gothic architecture. That shit's fucking insane. There's what is points pretty detailed? Like, you love points. I am box. retarded. I am retarded. <laughs> I am ESO. I love that meme. That's a good one. <laughs> oh, you know, no, shit, have you seen I the mean, one where he shit, like I... he shits out gold, <laughs> and then under the gold is shit? That's fucking great. Uh, are we floundering? You guys got anything else? Wait, wait, yeah, wait, 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 wait! I just wanted to say that um, I just watched Doon Kun's video, and it was sick. Oh yeah, the, um, no, one, no one wants to hear about no, that. No, 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 yeah. we're talking about everyone it. Everyone no. wants to hear no. about everyone wants to hear about Dune Kun's video, especially me. Yes. yes, it was great. It was uh it was like, hey, I'm gonna talk about Kage so much. Psych! I'm gonna talk about how bad anime is and how tropes are okay sometimes, but um most tropes are bad. Heard of this and, thing uh, called uh Big Bang Theory? Yeah, mm-hmm. yeah, that was great. I like um I like that compilation clip you did of um, like, oh my god, is that Mario Kart? <gasps> oh, I'm dying! <laughs> that was like the funniest <laughs> fucking thing ever. I, I What's hate the title people. of that video? It's the it's, Kage um, Summer Review. Yeah. The Kage okay. Summer Review by Doon yeah. Released. I'm not gonna uh, lie. I didn't click on it because I was afraid. I what, you afraid? <laughs> what were you afraid of? He loves no, Kage Summer. Season Summer. 2 yet. Uh, mm-hmm. Uh, I guess there's a bit of a spoiler, but um, I mean, not really. <laughs> yeah, not really. Spoiler: <laughs> spoiler nothing happens. Right. Get fucked. Spoiler: I mean, but, um, <laughs> That 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 scene in particular really resonated with me because so many people I see online in real life, I just want to die. I, like that photo of the guy shooting a bow into his own mouth is literally me when someone's like. Oh my god, is it, is that a JoJo reference? Oh, that's so funny! And it's like, oh, what I is wrong that. with like, you? You're literally, you're literally subhuman. JoJo reference oh. is the new Pickle Rick. So, do you guys remember the voicemail it's from worse, last episode? It definitely is. Where the guy said, like, hard dick sandwiches? Yeah. Oh yeah, it's a... Yeah. Is that it's a JoJo actually, reference? I'm gonna kill myself. asking our hot dog sandwiches, but he's just retarded. Oh, oh. wow, really? Yeah. Yeah. Which, no, um, hot dogs are hot dogs. Wait, dog. aren't if we supposed to review Procrastinators Anonymous on this show? Oh, shit. Isn't that uh, what Procrastinators Anonymous is? A little bit. <laughs> we should I mean, talk no, to no, no, no. Procrastinators Anonymous Anonymous also talk about... Uh, no, that's why I'm bringing up uh, the voice on for last episode. But yeah, mm. I guess should we answer mm. that now? Uh, yeah. Hot dog sandwiches? Hot dogs are not sandwiches, because they're called uh, hot dogs. If they were sandwiches, we would just... We would call them a sandwiches. Hot dog is a type of sandwich. No, yeah, I had a great hot dog. Hot dog is no, 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 like no, no because whenever something is a type of sandwich, you tack on sandwich at the end of it. Ham sandwich. Okay. Turkey okay. sandwich. No, not necessarily. Hot dog sandwich. Hot dog is a sandwich. I think all hot dogs are sandwiches, no. but not all sandwiches are hot dogs. No, no. Yes. <laughs> I think 
think that's correct. Yes, that's that's it. She needs solved it. That's a I mean, very slow argument because you no, no, oh, her no. Jury, put two pieces. Then, then what's the difference between a sandwich? sub and a fucking hot dog? Because people say sub sandwich. Yeah, right. literally because they say sub plant sandwich. Yeah, it's a sub because no, they no, say no, sub no, no, sandwich. No. What's the difference between a sub that you get from Subway and a hot dog? They call like, it a sub sandwich. That's the difference. Like literally, oh, like unironically, a rapper to the chart that Jurgen posted this the age old sandwich alignment. If chart. it's not traditionally mm. called a sandwich, it's not a sandwich. So what oh, you're, you're such is... a purist. Yeah, I think you're a bit um. Because if it, if it was a sandwich. If it was yeah. a sandwich, then why don't we call it a sandwich? Because it's not. That's, Different kind of dumb. sandwich, because it's got hot dog buns. That's what makes it a hot dog. Then you call it a sandwich. Why are you calling it a hot dog? Because it's a why type would, of sandwich. Because hot dog sandwich sounds retarded. And because like, yeah. hot dog like, is like, a magic exactly. like, colloquialism. Get fucked. No, no, it's no. It's still no, a no. type of sandwich. You, you, even, you even can't even argue against me. It's like, well, it, it's kind of retarded, you know, but still. No, it's retarded uh, to what, say it like that. Just because you don't that. say it, it's a, it's still a sandwich. You can't, it's, even, you can't even fucking it's justify meat and your shit point between bread. It's a sandwich. Oh, it's, it's a kind of sandwich. Kind of retarded. Um, it's called a hot dog because you Americans decided to call a sausage yeah, sandwich Americans a hot are dog. Fucking dumb. Whoa, hold on, yes, hold that's on, right. On. That's right. In Australia, we have sausage sandwiches. That's right. Instead of a bun, but we just use a, a piece bun, of bread. Though. No, we use a piece sausage of bread. But, but then it's, it's not it's a hot like, dog, it's a sausage It goes sandwich. both ways, it goes both ways. It's commonly with a piece of bread, however, you can use a fucking bun if you want. A bun a is just a piece dog. of bread, is it not? Yeah, it's but a hot dog. Just what makes the hot dog a hot dog is the hot dog bun and the sausage. I got a hot dog bun for you. Hot pockets and no, sausage for you. I want to talk about hot pockets. Hot pockets, uh, hot pocket sandwiches. It says on the box. Oh. Uh, it says yes. it on the box. Uh, I think we're uh, in agreement, though. Well, who am I to argue with Nestle? I'll just... Uh, well, okay, well, here's the distinction we're going to have to make. Uh, it, it, is it because some corporate fucking Jewish company put sandwich on the box or because people traditionally call it a sandwich? Because of the box. No. So so what, you okay. agree with corporations? Are you a corporate uh, shill, dude? This, it's their product. They can call it whatever they want. Yeah, but who true. cares? What they if want. I made a fucking okay, oh, okay, so you're making the argument that the guy who made gifs, he calls it gif, so therefore it's a gif. Gosh. It's gif, you motherfucker. No, it's, it's gif. It's gif oh, because my, the people oh. are the ones who are I'm in power. We're the, the ones who decide what things are, not these fucking corporate GIF shills. sounds better. Fuck fuck the creator. Oh my god. Were... Jelly, are you just death of the authoring? Are you like, yeah. It's fucking get yes, death it's literally death, death of the author. Honestly, I think you can say it either this. way because a work belongs both to the creator and to the um audience. So the creator says it's GIF. Some people listen, say GIF. Listen. The creator says the, uh, you can call GIF. it GIF if you want. Is, if you're an author like and you post your shit publicly, it's no longer yours. It's out for the world mm. for everyone else to take and to manhandle and to squish and, and to rip write. and tear. Rip and tear and as rape. they please. No, hold on, Jelly. It, because if I put out a fucking video like, oh, I don't like this show, and people can't look take it and be like, oh, he actually does like this show. He is just lying. Yes, like, I no. can. I can literally edit I your mean, audio to make it sound like that. Yes. No, then you're making your own thing. That's different. That's not just but reinterpreting I'm taking, it. I'm taking yours and I'm changing you're reinterpreting it. I'm it. Derivative content, dude. That's our whole brand is derivative content. No, but this is an original podcast. It's, it's, it's technically <laughs> driven, but it's like a, it is a new product in and of itself. Like how a, a review of something is a new product in itself. A review is its own piece of art. Separate review from is original. not art, by the way. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to say it. I'm going to take the hot take. Reviewing uh, is not art. You fucking seen my videos? They're high art. <laughs> hey, hey, Dune Coon's yeah. video well, is high well, see, art. Here's that the thing, was dude. good. You're calling it a review. It's not really a review. Uh, I put it on the fucking box, Jelly. It's a review. Oh, okay. No, oh, no, no, it's the author. It's it's the author. Jelly, it's boys, children. Um, anything can be art children. if you make it. You yes, me. you are a child. Yes, I knew that'd get you. Um, uh, <laughs> anything can be art if you put the effort into it to make it art. But how something much effort? isn't what? like no. all games. How much effort? No. Anything how much effort? can be art if you call it art. 
Anything That's why people can oh, put a oh, fucking so toilet art, in the middle of a museum. So it's not a sandwich unless you call it a sandwich. Thanks for proving <laughs> my point. Thanks oh, for proving fuck. my fucking point. But they call it <laughs> sandwiches <laughs> in the okay. in I fucking Australia. Modernist. Jesus fucking Christ. So like, not like people can say games are art. That doesn't mean all games are oh, art. It's a jelly Empty, bean shallow, sandwich. meaningless things are not <laughs> art. <laughs> but some people can put like thematic things oh, and can put gone. meaning Jesus. and artistic value into things that aren't traditionally thought of as art. Okay, a banana taped to wall is art. Fight me. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, it is art. Uh, oh yeah, I'll it's art if you're a fucking retard. Sure. No, what the fuck does that mean? How, who is it's subjective? Is he, uh, Jelly? No, it's yeah, not. No, I, I am God. Correct, I, everything no. passes through my perception. I am the objective standard by which things are measured. He is correct, though. Like, if someone thinks that that banana taped to a wall is art and brings out some sort of artistic um, feeling within them, then uh, congratulations, Jelly. You're right. It is art. Imagine I there's if you, if no you, niggas. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's easy. Oh. It's easy. <laughs> that, that's that's our anthem. That's our, our podcast beautiful anthem. ethno. Uh, that's our end game. I want a fucking this, this dog. Oh, Jesus has been our end Christ! Game. <laughs> All the Jews oh. below us. <laughs> Jesus, we're the worst podcast. We are the worst podcast. Good thing that's... no one watches the anonymous anonymous cast. Yeah, good no, thing no one watches this podcast. I think a couple hundred people actually watch it. The progression. Ah, they the know we're joking. <laughs> ruling all the world. Uh, yeah. you, uh, may, uh, you may you say, might say I'm a racist. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, karaoke cast. But I'm not the only one. <laughs> Therefore, Fucking I'm correct. I hope someday that, that's the jelly argument. you'll join us. <laughs> Fucking end it, the kill world. it. God, we, oh my God. we're truly No, we haven't yeah. finished the debate. What's the debate? I've already the blown debate everyone is jelly's out of the water. I blown everyone out of the fucking I was water. Not no, I'm I'm I don't How want to hear shit from you. Fuck you. You want to fuck all the commenters? Because you know you're wrong. Do you want to fuck no. all the commenters, or do you only want to fuck I'm the commenters that are correct. children? Oh no! Yes, Jelly. I think Jelly. I love your Jelly Beaner nigger sandwich right here. Better <laughs> I than I love it. A better than uh, the anime. Say I love you. I think it's a superior piece of art. <laughs> uh, right no, that is art. That's, that's literally <laughs> art because it involves me. <laughs> so is everything that like involves you just art? Yes. Could I make so so this this playthrough I'm doing right here on on oh. on on Discord of um of me playing Heroes of Might and Magic? Heroes is this art? Might and magic. Am I yeah. involved? You are. Yes. It's cool, whether you like it or not. Yes. Hmm. Yes, excellent. Yes. Good to know. Yes. Yes. Good. All right, this is dumb. I'm, what I, have, you, I have what Craig leave. Uh, I have typed out. I'm ready to press enter at any fucking second. Oh, wait, 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 Hold on. This, is, you, this has been you put a on, hot dog on episode two. Inside of a roll. But it's not split. It's like a donut, you know, like a long donut. Does that count? Donut episode two. Fuck Last of Us 2. Uh, uh, Jews. Yeah, fuck fuck, fuck big nose people. Fuck, um, fuck, fuck people fuck ruining my games. Dog. Fuck. Last of uh, Us Two was supposed to be goat, and now it's ruined. Fuck the people in in the TPC rewatch chat. TPC. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Yeah, they they're the so mad because they think I'm an anti-Semite, and it's really fuck funny. The PCP. Do they? Fuck Jelly. Uh, yeah, fuck, the people in there don't like uh, they, They're all fucking <laughs> fuck hot dogs. Yeah, all, these, really all these god all these wait i have i i hate I all these fucking sincerity bros so much they just don't they just don't get jokes <laughs> they just don't, people don't oh, get jokes there's, anymore. Such, there's no nuance there's such literally it's it's like, like how do you live like that we can't, we can't go on another yeah. fucking no, look, look, the podcast is over. Jelly's sick of it. Um, all you fucks, yeah. shut the yeah, fuck Jelly's up. Jelly's sick of your games. shit, you guys. This, you this podcast is going to be longer than the other one if we keep going. Uh, yeah, it's good. been an hour and 20. Oh, God, oh, no. no. This, this is not how the podcast this is supposed to be. To the end. first one was 20 minutes. <laughs> I think, um, can 
we're gonna have to break money, this up and into three parts so we can <laughs> so we can make profit off of it. No, if we keep going, we can profit, break it up profit, into seven, profit, seven profit, parts. Keep profit, people sitting profit, on their profit. seats, desperate please, for the next please, part. Please, dude, save us. End it. All right, I'm clicking it in three. Put two, me out of my fucking misery. Reverse sinking. Bye. 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 Bye.